we are live. And guess what? I have special guest, guys. Woohoo! What's up? Mitch Quist from Stone Coat Cannon Club. And Mr. Keith Guinness. Mm, pound it. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, guys. It's been one of those nights. All right. So what I want you to do before we get started, yep. introduce yourself, where they can get in touch with you. Cool. I'm Mitch Quist with Stone Coat Countertops. You can find us at StoneCoatCountertops.com for all of our products. Please turn your mic on. Or Sorry. you can find us at YouTube at Stone Coat Countertops. Keith, take it away. I'm Keith McGinnis with KCDC Designs out of Eagle, Nebraska. Hi, Mitch. <laughs> you can find me on Facebook at KCDC Designs. Uh, I'm honored to be here <laughs> with these two. Uh, it's been a fun day so far. So I'm here just to uh, kind of stir things up with RK3 Designs. So let's get at it. All right. So these guys are sharing a mic. They really don't like each other that much, but <laughs> they are going to be really close tonight. So yeah, it's going <laughs> to be All right. Epic. So what we're doing, first of all, I am so glad that you guys are joining in tonight. It, I can't even tell you what, what's going to happen tonight. It's going to be crazy. So all of our newcomers... Make sure that you let us know where you're joining us from. I promise it's not going to be this chaotic every Tuesday night, but we're going to have Maybe. a good time. Maybe. Um, hi to all of our, mo our, our moderators out there. I think Clara, uh, well, actually, Clara's sitting right over here. You think Clara's on? Well, I didn't know she was on yet. So Clara <laughs> is actually sitting right back here. We have Vamp. Not on. Vamp's here. Yeah. Not Clara. sure. Yeah. Is Erica here? Yeah. Hot dog. She, Everybody's she's here. A little jelly right now. Is she jelly? Oh, yeah. I miss you girls. See you soon. Okay, so tonight what we're doing, it's me against them. There we go. We got this. Yes. So we need your input, guys. And we really sort of kind of have an idea of what we're doing. Basically, we've just kind of mixed some colors up and we're going to see what happens. So we need your input. Let us know what you think and give us some feedback as we go. Yeah. All righty. So I guess let's get started. What we have here is um, because I didn't know they were all going to be able to get here in time to do a live tonight. So we kind of had to throw this together at the last minute. So the guys are working on a countertop, yep. a piece of a countertop that we fabricate in our pro classes. We teach them how to do a, a smooth edge and we teach them how to do a rock be, uh, face edge. So that's what they're doing. They're gonna just share this piece. Mm -hmm. So that's gonna be fun. I'm just on this little piece by myself over here and it's also just a piece of half inch MDF. And what we're gonna be doing tonight, we're going to be using our uh, dark brown or brown opaque dye Mm -hmm. And it's been tinted very opaque. This is one of my very favorite browns, guys. Don't you love this brown? I do. I like it because you can make it transparent yep. by putting just a tiny bit, or you can make it very opaque. Mm -hmm. So we'll be using that. And then we're going to be using a little bit of black. Now, I gave these guys those colors in their cups. Now, they can use it how they want to. It's all going to be kind of what you want to do. Um, so that's black opaque dye, and then we're going to be coming in with olive green, or this is what I'm doing. They have the mm -hmm. same colors. I'm not sure if you're all going like to use those or not. Green. Olive green mica powder, available on my website. Chameleon mica powder, available on my website. And dark bronze, available on my website. Um... And let's see what else we have. Oh, we have the olive green. All righty. That's our color palette, guys. That's what we have. And it is game on. It is. So here we I go. I saw Rhonda make this in front of her students at the last hands-on training class. And I've been dying to make it again. So yeah. I was pumped when you said. So in the class, right. we only use dark bronze. Yeah, just two colors, right? Yeah. So we're adding a little bit of. Adding some flair. Yeah, some flair to it. All right. So. Here we go. Let's do All right, this. Let's do this. All right. I'm taking my brown. I'm taking my brown. Remember, we got to put a little bit of our brown in the community. So I'm taking this section. Keith's taking the rock face section. And this is going to be community property where we both kind of just 
do a little little fun, That'll right? That'll probably be the winning yeah, area that's right. right there. No. It'll be two, sure. it'll be two epoxy masterminds no. melding together. I don't think so. All right, so I'm just going to kind of meld out my dark brown. Add a little to community. So are y'all going to do the same kind of design, or is it just free fall? We free don't fall. know. Free fall, yeah. I think they're going to try mm. to cheat. This. All right, yeah, now, yeah. this I'm is my black, so I have oh, brown opaque, and now this is the <laughs> black. All, you. <laughs> Very little black. The black will take over. Keith is already... All right, then I'm going to come in, and <laughs> yeah. I'm just going to kind of slightly meld this. Now, you're not going to be able to tell the difference on camera, but this... In the sunlight, if it were, say, in your kitchen, you would be able to distinguish. Boys, wow. I'm going to have to get after hey, you two so boys. Before you start doing the melding and stuff, yep. give me a second. Yeah. So she's done. Oh, then sure. that totally. Way yep, yep, yep. So if you see this in the natural light, you can distinguish between the dark brown the and the black. black. The black. Sorry. <laughs> all right. So all I've done is meld <laughs> out. Now, I don't think you guys are going to no, be able to see. Yeah, see you can't see the so difference. Like but like I said, black. yeah, it looks black. But in the, the natural light, you can tell. Now, another way you can tell ooh, 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 cool. is the way that the mica powders are going to react to out. each color. Okay. All right, so yeah, I'm going to let this sit for just a second. And I need a torch. I forgot to get a torch. Ooh, All right, so, so did show I. us what you're doing, Mitch. I'm using my hands. Today's project, I'm going to use my fancy tool, which is a gloved fingers. I just have my black and brown down, just like Rhonda. I'm making my board wet with epoxy, and then I'm going to layer on my uh, additional colors. And meld those together. This project is repeatable, pretty simple. And, and layering in extra colors like we're doing today, I tell you, you could just up-level these projects to your customers' homes if you do this for a living. Just add new colors, add a, a color that the customer wants in their home to this style. You got a whole new countertop. Don't forget your edges, even though I'm running low. Oh, you're going all in. I like it. All right. Going all out. <laughs> okay. So, Hold on, Ron. Yeah. oh yeah, oh yeah, come on now, mister. Steal my thunder. Wait, hang on a second, you have to see. Go, go, Keith, it's your turn. Okay, yeah, I can hear you. <laughs> okay, okay. Yeah, just talk loud. I'm just, I'm being random on how I pour out my how colors. How random? Random, Rhonda, random. Oh. <laughs> and then I'm going to smear my colors out. Smear them, huh? Smear them out. Okay. And, but I really sure have to go them. with the feng shui. Right. And then I'll probably mute him just a little bit. Okay, y'all are making fun of me, I think. I got made fun of for using smear. smear. Did you get smear. teased for that, just too? Just try yeah. to get some depth in there as well. Rhonda, nobody would make fun of you. I don't yeah. know. Ooh, I'll take you some clear. My community area? I oh, did. Yeah. I did a little bit. I'll take some of that clear. I get in trouble for saying shake skis. Give it a good shake skis. Oh, yeah? yeah Not sure is. what a shake ski is. I don't either. It just came out one day. I'm going to write a book one day. All my words that I say. Trail. My trial? <laughs> I can't even say it. Skip trial? Trial? Nothing, nothing, nothing. Skip trial? All right. That's what politicians do. Yeah, yesterday when I was leaving, packing up, I was calling my wife, ma'am, yes, ma'am, no, ma'am. She goes, you're practicing for Texas. That's right. Said, yes, ma'am. <laughs> all right. Hey, this looks, this could yeah, be a good. finish all on its own. That is cool. Are you going to take it to the next level, Mitch? I am. I am. I hope so. All right. I hope, I hope so. <laughs> hey, are you fixing to do something, or are you just going to leave it like that? You know, that could be a finish. All right, I'm Wait fixing to do something. All on its own. Don't, Don't cheat. Don't this. look. I'm, I know. I was I'm cheating. You saw around. that. Smear it around. Yeah. Colors may get muted just a little bit. They might get muted. <laughs> they might get muted. All right, so Kenny, come show them what I'm doing before Hold I start. On. You're... Oh. you're... <laughs> He's smearing it. He's smearing it. I don't want to mix the colors. Just trying to fill my bare spots. Ooh, 
that's pretty, Keith. I like that. Going for the win, baby. Well, you're not gonna win. <laughs> <laughs> it's a good try, though. All right. Well. Okay, my stuff's getting yeah, get, set up get over here. Rhonda. But I'm watching Mitch here. He's brushing it out. Ooh, back whoa. Hello. All right, so what I've done is I've taken my dark bronze and I very lightly have um, drizzled it. Going with a very oh random here. And look at this chameleon, guys. Look at the color. Isn't that pretty? It's got a little hint of green. That's why I chose to add a little bit of my olive green. Mm. All right, so we're just going to add a little bit. And this chameleon will take over very quickly. Ooh. So I'm just adding a little bit. And then I'm going to come in here with my olive green. And then I'm going to cross hatch. Mm -hmm. And I want to leave some negative space so that that brown can kind of peekaboo through. All right. All right, so I love that right there. And I'm gonna let it kind of sit a little bit. And I'm gonna move it just a little bit. Now, if you're doing this on a countertop, obviously you won't have the ability to tilt it. And that's okay. Because it's gonna move on its own. Anyway, all right, isn't that pretty? Now I wanna kinda of just let it kinda of do its thing. I am gonna come over here now with some kinda of random veins. I feel not worthy. I'm telling you. All right, so I'm gonna go Looking pretty. All right, veins. okay. I'm bringing on a little of this. Where's my alcohol? What have we forgot about our community piece? All right. Big time. No, no, we haven't. No, we haven't. You got a big one. Oh, damn, I don't know that one. All right, we're going to bring that together in this area right here. Where's the oh. alcohol? I really don't know what I'm doing with that. Wow. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Let's see what you got here. Ooh, no, no that's very beautiful. Yeah. Isn't that pretty? Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. I'm just I'm not saying that. That's true. It does. Yeah, let alone for what angle that you're looking at it. Man. Candy Grinch, he says that's a nice looking rock edge there. Yeah. All right, so. He put the alcohol right here. Look at that. That almost looks like a tortoise. Like if you put bigger Thank you. alcohol things in there. Yeah, how it's selling like that, you're right. That could be a tortoise right there. Okay, so. I'm gonna let this sit. I'm not near finished. Yeah. All right, so I've put some veins and I've kind of let my veins sit for a little bit. And by moving these veins, I get a shift a little bit. Almost like these veins kind of cause a little bit of a talk. shadow. What? I said I start getting focused. And so I've done that. Talking. Now I'm gonna, this, this <laughs> could be a finish all on its own. But I am definitely going to take it to the next level. So look at this, I love. So by leaving negative space, guys, letting that brown and that black show through, Ooh, you're go. gonna get some really cool designs. 
and they're going to be distinct. So I love it, and I love these veins. Now, if I weren't doing this on a live, I would wait for about 30 minutes or so before I came in here with these veins so that my veins stayed a little more distinct and they, they wouldn't soften quite as much as they're going to soften here. But I actually do really like this. Ann says, wow, the alcohol really makes it pop, Mitch. Yes, okay. it out well. Mitch, that's gorgeous. All right. Bigger drop. All right, so now yeah, that y'all see this. Drip drip. All right, so I'm fixing to go to the next level, y'all. So where's my... Hey, 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 hey. What? Hey. Oh, I made it rain on you. Wow. <laughs> You'll thank me later. He's sabotaging by this. Oh, actually... The big drops are a good call, Kenny. Oh, man, with the light on there? Yeah, like that bigger drops. Oh, that's pretty. Okay, Kenny, I'm fixing to go to the next level here. All right, coming this way. The chameleon that peeks mm. through Isn't it. Isn't that beautiful? Sweet. I love it. I love it. Goes it goes well with the green, Ronnie. Yep. Good call. Because the chameleon oh, has a little like green. Off of it. Yeah. Okay, pretty. so guys, this could be a finish, like I said. This but is done. I don't want we're going to go to the one. next level. What are you doing? I'm going to fog with black. Ooh. You want to see what dragon and I'm not going 100% opaque, all righty? So you can still kind of see, and I'm going to come over. Big drops. I'm going to come in with some bigger drops, my Italian drip here. What? <laughs> I'm, surprised it's not, I'm surprised it's not Dos Equis. 21% okay. alcohol. Now, I'm going to let this kind of do its thing. And then I'm even going to go to another step. But this actually could be a finish on a, all on its own as well. When you add alcohol over your spray paint, you cannot judge it immediately. You have to let the alcohol evaporate and cause all this yumminess that's going on. But this is an amazing, this kind of tones down some, some of those really bright it, colors. Right? So if you wanted to put this in a space Ooh. where you didn't want those colors to be quite so vivid, you could kind of do this and really tone it down. So I'm gonna let this sit for just a little bit and then we'll come back and do one more thing. So let me know guys Done. in the comments, did you like my first one or my second one? And here in a minute, we're gonna do a third one. The glove trick. I love doing this with the metallics. When yes. they're heavy, kind of brings it to the surface mm -hmm. and creates these little fine yes, lines. Yes, isn't that pretty? Yeah, what a cool color combo. And I really like to do this uh, with the so glove. Like cool this says, Keith looks awesome. Thank you. <laughs> Who's Mike for cool? You do it. You That's Kenny's brother. Oh, okay. I don't know. Thanks, Mike. You do this later as it I sets? do. Yes, I do it later because what happens is mm -hmm. then when you re-wake up those mm -hmm. mica powders, it really does. Dark calm. Yes, yep. it's yep. like boom. Cool color combo. I'm going to torch it real quick. Oh, yeah, I like how this is kind of... Yeah. Ooh. I love that. Me? Yikes. Copy. All right. Keep, that's when Keith hogged my all my black. All he up. took all the black Here, from Here, Here I have black. Go. Here, I have black. Oh, I'm just black? trying to get my front edge. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, I feel the weight of the bus. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. You've been thrown under that bad yep, boy. It's heavy. You got a, you got a you, lot of this in here, too. Put over here in the middle of that. Let me that? see. Yeah, what is that? I think you did some spray paints on it or something. Oh, huh? is that what it is? I did that when nobody was looking. Yeah. That's beautiful. That is pretty cool. I like that a lot. It's kind of like a paisy look. Yeah. yeah. That is really pretty. I like that. Uh, what did you? Uh huh? So was it I spray paint? I had a wet gloved hand, and then I sprayed some champagne bronze. Okay. And I also used a, a hammered black. Okay. And just kind of melted that in. Oh. Yeah. That's beautiful. I can't see the front at all. Man. Ooh. Probably winning. I don't. You're good. I mean, it's close. It's it's close, oh but win. I don't know about yeah. that. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we can't stop. I can't tell how the front looks. So it looks just, good. I'm just going to leave covered. it. Yeah, it's covered. Okay. All right. 
I'm cool. gonna go to the next step, guys. Me too. Okay. Are we layering more? Maybe. Yes. I love coming to your, to Texas because I've been what? watching Mike and been working with epoxy for five, six years, and I learn stuff every single time I come out. Yeah. Here. When awesome. you stop learning, right? You better be dead. Amen. <laughs> because if you can't learn every right. single time you make a pour, then you're missing an opportunity. Okay, so guys, if you remember, I sprayed it with black, spritz it with a little bit of alcohol, and look how it's starting mm -hmm. to kind of just build on its own. But we're going to go to the next step. I don't know. So I'm going to come in now, and I'm actually going to put another layer of my bronze. What was the green we used? It was olive green. Olive green. Uh huh. Olive green. That's one of the new ones. Uh, well, no, no, the royal not, is. Not, the royal is. No. All right. So I added I some more like of the green. dark bronze. Do y'all yeah. have any more dark bronze left, or do y'all uh, use it on? No. That's all right. Okay. And now I'm gonna come back and I'm gonna very lightly. You know what? I'm gonna add a little bit of chameleon as well. Where'd my chameleon go? Just a little bit. I want some, I want some little peekaboos of chameleon yeah. ever so often. You should say it's just a big glare. That's how we can see it's Rhonda. Oh, then let me step back. Um, yeah. There's nothing you can do about that. It's just All right. It is what it is. All right. So I'm kind of coming over here and I'm re... Turn the lights off. Mike, turn the lights off over there. Turn, turn, the one turn off. them no. lights down low. Turn them lights down low. They'll see it in person. There you go. All right, is that any better, guys? Not me. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Turn, turn the. This one on it. Ooh, maybe I should do a tiny white in my vein. All right, so by re-hashing so cool. yeah, it out, cross-hashing, right? I'm actually so adding long one long more long. layer of depth. And I didn't do the whole surface. I left some of the black spray paint. I left some of that uh, first layer. And as this kind of starts to sit, you're going to get... Back up. Let me, I, gotta, I need to torch it one more time. And I'm going to move it a little bit. Oh. And by moving it, see... I get some really cool designs. Uh, who said that? Oh, yes. Thank you. All right. I think I'm going to let them tell me what to do next. So this is Mitch's right here. I might miss some more alcohol on that here in a minute. No, I don't like that. All right, then we're going to the community service over here. Yeah. I brought in some white, but I don't know. I'm going to have to layer. Ooh, that is so pretty. Oh, what's that, white? Yeah, it's kind of loud, isn't it? All right, I need the guys to tell me what I need to do, if I need to stop or not. I'm going to poll the audience. Now I'm going to grab one. Serious. Awesome. Oh my goodness. Okay. I don't know what else to do. Okay. 
Okay, well then we need to show what I'm doing. <laughs> All right, so I'm not going to get crazy like them with paint. I'm going to use this. Okay. Mike, Mike's coming back. Do it. <laughs> Me? The color combo with that alcohol is fire. Yep. It's, you time that right with the alcohol in that? Yes, it's gorgeous. Pretty. All right, so what I'm doing, guys, I really don't want to take it a whole lot more. I'm just coming in. And I'm just making some little small veins every so often, kind of giving it some real distinct because it's very melded. So I want to come in here now and actually create some designs for the eye to really follow. So this is my green, straight oh, green. Hey, mama, Yay, mama, hi, mama Quist. Mama, Mama Quist, you. don't let Mitch beat me. <laughs> What's she going to do about it? She can get after him I when he gets I can't bribe home. my mom with free epoxy. She yeah. has all the old bottles stored <laughs> at her house. <laughs> yes, Keith is so helpful. All right. Legit. Okay, so my that was with the green. I'm going to come back so with a little helpful. bit you're, of the chameleon. You're such a. And I'm just barely. Like, I don't want this. Is, this is already pretty busy you. as it is. You're awesome, but I want to just kind of add like, just a little bit so many people. It's awesome. to where it just has some kind of, I don't know, I guess distinct lines in it. Mitch, your mama says, go Mitch, go Mitch. <laughs> <laughs> okay, guys. All right, we're going to have to call it. All right, guys, so. Right. And. Wow. Oh, in. Yeah. Uh, Clara, give us a countdown. In 10, we have to stop. Uh oh. So okay. give us a countdown right. from 10. 10, 9, Three. 8, 7, seven 6, six hit it. 5, four. 4, 3, 2, <laughs> 1. All right. <laughs> Woo -hoo. Step back. Step back. Woo! Give me some. All right. Give me some. All right, All right guys. So here's what you need to oh, do again. you need to vote for me. That's it. <laughs> How about, that's your choice, vote for me. <laughs> All right, so here we go. Keith is one, Mitch is two, I'm three. Vote, we're gonna give you a couple of minutes, so start voting, and Clara, you think you can keep up maybe? And Vamp and Erica, maybe kind of y'all get together and decide who wins. So. All right, so do you wanna do, we need to talk about the challenge? Okay, so. While they're doing that, let's let's do let's do a few announcements. Uh, so I did re uh, release the details on our challenge for September. I'm going to be. I know it was kind of vague. Uh, we're going to be adding some more um, details. So there's some pictures that I posted of some stone that I actually picked up when we were in Alaska. I'm going to be posting some more of those videos. I finally got them off my uh, iPad, and I'm going to be posting those in the insiders group uh, and also my alumni group. That way you'll have more um, pictures to kind of choose from. So uh, what we're going to do is, Mitch, I'm glad you're here. Yeah. So we need to decide, and we'll let you know. We'll post this tomorrow. But... Uh, this big challenge that mm -hmm, I have, mm -hmm. so we need to decide what we're going to do for, for yeah. prizes. Let's do a big prize if it's I mean, challenge. I want to be, it's going to be big. It's going to be a month long, and it's going to be big. So here's the deal. One entry per person, okay? You can't enter four or five different pieces. It's one piece. Make it a good one. Make it a good one. And here's how you register, how you, you enter. You have to hashtag it, okay? Smart. Yes, hashtag it, and I forgot my hashtag. So, <laughs> uh, <laughs> I think it's hashtag. I forgot my hashtag. I'll, have, I'll, I'll find my hashtag in just a minute, guys. Sorry, but you have to do a video that's under five minutes. It could be cool. thirty seconds. It could be two minutes, but it has to be under five minutes. It does not have to be a tutorial, meaning you don't have to do a step by step what you did. Right. But it must include all of the supplies 
that you used. All the colors, either you used a mica powder or a paste, what brand you used, you have to put all of that in your description. And then I need at least two to three photos from different angles of that piece. All right? So, so was sounds it RT3 fun. Marble Challenge? That's it. Is that it? Hashtag no. RT3 Marble no. Challenge. That was the other one. No, okay, this I'm one, asking. yeah, no guys, I will I will give you the hashtag here in just a minute. I'll actually go and look. Um, or I will post it, I'll, I'll have to look. I'm sorry, because the girls did it for me, so I can't remember what they hashtagged it at. Um, but I, if someone knows, if they can if they can post it, if they know what that hashtag is, They're let me looking. let me know. Okay. Right. Um, I got so, a prize in mind. You got a prize? Mm -hmm. Okay. I think I'm gonna donate a two gallon kit, a top coat, an undercoat and 10 additives. Wow. Wow, that's awesome. Mm. Okay, so that's gonna be one prize. I don't Can know if I it's good. Can I your moderator for about a month? Same here. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so our moderators are not allowed to join us. So tomorrow. <laughs> They're retiring now. That's it. Not know. good. So tomorrow I'm gonna be Rhonda, posting, yes. Did you post it four days ago? RK3 Coffee Cat Challenge? Yes, Ooh, that's, that's it. That's a cool hashtag. That's it. The Alaska Rocks. Can I join this challenge? Yeah. So the hashtag is RK3 Copycat Challenge. Ooh, that's a okay? cool Okay, I'm going to post again tomorrow on our business page, our um, insiders page, the RK3 Designs insiders page, as well as our alumni. Now, um, if you don't have a Facebook, you can email me your entries at Rhonda at rk3designs.com. You can send the video and at least two or three photos. So if you didn't get all of this right now, don't worry about it. I'm going to post a very detailed post tomorrow. But Mitch has said what he's gonna donate. We're Ooh. still working on some cool prizes, guys. I've got a couple more people that I'm waiting to hear from. I believe Erica's gonna be donating something as well. Ooh, cool. So it's gonna be big. Can and we it's going to be good. Co insiders to join this challenge? Absolutely. Okay. Absolutely. All right, guys. So it's going to be huge. I'm so excited. Um, all right. So are we ready to have y'all yeah. got the. Do I don't know who it was? Yeah. Who was it? Who was it? Who was it? You guys already oh. tallied? No, 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 no. Yeah. No, no. It, was a, it was a no, no, no brainer. Hang on, hang on. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to yeah. raise up arms here. You know, you know, the winner here. Can Keith, you step up a Rhonda. little bit? Step up a little bit. And the winner yeah, is, sir. drum roll. And the winner is, Whoa. Yeah. Yeah. He Epic. He cheated. Ooh. He cheated. That's his it. Is, you cheated. This is epic. Go it's home the, tomorrow. This is Ron Dakwa that brought the W. That's it. Thanks, everybody. I did like your flow you, you, you had going on there. Oh, that's awesome. Wow. That's it was awesome. the feng shui. I had the feng shui You had the going. flow going. Hey, it was the rock edge. That's yeah! Exactly <laughs> what it That's what it was. The Actually, y'all, to truth be known, tell them, I told you what to do. <laughs> you I heard told right. me where to go. <laughs> <laughs> that too. All or right, guys. RK3designs.com. Yes, that's right. So check out our website for all these products. Guys, we do same day shipping if you order before noon. And we also do free shipping. Yes, I said free shipping on all orders over a hundred dollars so check out our website rk3designs.com okay guys how about some somebody, likes somebody asked for a passover fly over okay flyover. really quick yep. before we wait really quick before we do that if you think this is fun guys the rest of this week you need to stay close to your whatever you join social media with because it's going to be so much Fun. We're going to go live. Mm -hmm. We're going to have all kind of collaborations. Yep. I'm not going to let Keith in any of them. <laughs> no. <Nope. but laughs> no. He gets handicapped from this That's day right. forward. That's right. All right, guys. Uh, yeah, so do a flyover yeah, really quick. And then you'll get it. Yeah. Keith so you, gets we'll show the, the winner first. Where's the alcohol? Suck. That's awesome. That's Dude, beautiful. the flow is great, Keith. Really yeah, nice. And beautiful. I like how much uh, chameleon you got showing. Yeah. I was scared of the chameleon, you, and it you paid off. The chameleon. I, I did. Dude, it you paid showed, off. I he also hogged colors. all the black, so I was handicapped. I have no black on mine. Wait, wait, wait. Where'd the blue come from? That wasn't in the color palette. Oh, we were loud. 
Oh, oh yeah? it was whatever you want. Oh, yep. Cool. Yeah, it was open. Keith, it looks okay. beautiful. Hey, I, I know what it takes to win when I'm at RT3. Yeah, turquoise. The Ron Dakwa for the W. Ron Dakwa. For the W. Ron Dakwa. For the W. Got a bubble. Yeah, that is They're really all, cool. you know, installable surfaces. And dark colors are trending in 2023. Oh my gosh, look at that. Mitch, that is gorgeous. Look at that vein. Oh my gosh, that's beautiful. Yeah, Let's bring in a little that. light. That is so pretty. Ooh, that comes alive with that light. Mm-hmm, do mine too. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> For sure. It does, all those mica powders. I know, isn't that pretty? I just well, love the depth. You got a lot of chameleon color. too. I love it. Just I was scared up. of it. <laughs> Teacher's pet. Ooh, Teacher's pet. Pretty. It's there pretty. You know, I like the fine lines you have going on too. I do. They're pretty. Yeah, and yeah, that's yeah. what's going to be fun is these yeah. lines are going to get a little bit softer, softer. So, softer. Okay, guys. Yes. Quit. The the it's well, over. Now we're gelling. We're gelling Stop. up, so it's perfect timing. <laughs> All right. <laughs> guys, thank y'all. We had so much fun. The I mm, I just love. Well, I love my fun. family. I just love. I love you guys. Thanks, Mike. Same. Yeah. So, okay, guys. So, like I said, stay tuned. This week, we will be going live. We have a pro class. It is booked solid. Uh, it's going to be so much fun. We have people coming from all over the United States to come to this class, and we are so excited. So, like I said, we will be going live several times through now and Saturday, and then these guys are actually staying through next week. So Epic. we are going to be doing some amazing projects. Projects. All right, y'all have anything to say? No, thanks for. Well, when's your next class? This one's booked out. When's the yeah, next so one the next time? class is next your put, class? the yeah. next. Okay, we have an October class, and it is our two uh, or three day. We have a combo. You can either come the two days, or you can pay for the extra day, and you get the three day combo class. Um, I'm not sure exactly what the date is. Oh, now we do have a class coming up called the designer finish his class. Mm. Guys, the Whoa. last time I hosted this class was over a year ago. We have Jennifer Ferguson from Artistic Painting Studio coming in from California, and we are going to create some amazing, super high-end finishes that nobody in the country is doing but us, and it is going to be amazing. Worth That's it. going to be the uh, end of October, so go right. to my uh, page, RK3 Designs, under the workshop tab, and check out the descriptions on all of our classes. Our next pro class is in November. Guys, I think I only have six spots left already. It's booking up. And that's going to be the last pro class for 2022. That's and my then birthday month. That's Kenny's birthday mm. month. Well, my birthday's next week. How about that? Mm. So, hmm. Well, uh, my birthday's this month. I'm going to be 29 and holding. 29. So, happy birthday. I'm going to be 30. 29. All right, guys, until next week, we love you. And remember, don't be scared. Move forward and be creative. Very creative. Ready? You got this? And from Stone Coat Countertops, you, you got, got this. this. We'll see you on the next live video at RK3 Designs. Adios. Bye. See ya. Later. Legit.